this was, as soon as I saw it, I was like, this looks so sick. But I do think it is, um, you know, a classic turn-based RPG, which I'm not always a fan of just because of how, how slow they can be. Hopefully, it, it, you know, it does it right and it makes, you know... The, th the problem is a lot of battles in JRPGs for me, um, they're just nothing, right? They're just grind. They're just part of the grind. That's what I don't like, the grind, the slow grind. Um, hopefully, this one has, has some interesting twists on it because it looks super freaking cool. I, we have to play it. It's called Small Saga. And you're like an army of mice or something. You've got to fight a, it's like a giant cat. It looks, it looks so cool, but the art style's really neat as well. Yeah, I'm hoping this, this can do some good stuff. Small saga. Look at the art style. Oh my god, what the hell is going on? Oh yeah, that's because it's the... Remember? I did that from last time, so... That's what it should look like, yeah. It looks the same for me right now. We're gonna we're gonna try and full screen it. Uh, max. I don't know what that means, but uh, I guess we'll just go on. Return new game. Look at it though. Look at it. Rumors of new KI in the works. Well, that's Dom's life gone. <laughs> Dom's gonna disappear into new KI like Lewis disappeared in a slap shot. I wonder if Keats has anything to do with it. Spring. The Under River. The sewers. What manner of vermin lurks beneath our feet? Me! We are the vermin. Yeah, look how ah, it's so cute! Follow the arrow. Come on, Verm, keep up. Lance and Verm. I'm doing my best, Lance, but your legs are twice the size of mine. Ah, this won't do it all. Here's an idea. Why don't you take the lead for a bit? Think I'm ready? I have no doubt. You know what? I'm going to turn this music up a bit because I think it's a bit quiet for you guys, but I'm going to turn it down on my end. I have no doubt. Oh. Come on. According to Dad's letter, we just follow the arrows. They point the way to the God's Food Hoard. So just keep following the path. We should hit it in no time. All right, I can do this. This kid's going to die immediately. <laughs> Stay on my tail, bro. Yes, we are the guy. Mouse Warrior Pro Tip. Hold X to run, C to open the menu. Sava? We can go out here, but it doesn't do anything. Lollipop sticks. What a weird bridge. Looks like the Under River, like Under River Rat handiwork. It's crude, but it should hold. Under River Rats. Do you think there are any around right now? It's possible we didn't bring any our weapons just for sure. Are you scared? A little. Maybe a little. That's okay. There's no shame feeling fear. All mice feel it. Dude, rats are like 10 times the, the size of... 10 times the size of, uh, of mice. All mice, even Blade Master Leo. Glad you're doing this. It looks ace. Yeah, it's super beautiful looking. So cute. Um, uh, the, the, the combat seems interesting as well. It's just, it's even called Small Saga. Obviously, you're going to be fighting things way bigger than you and stuff. It's just nice, right? All mice, even Blade Master Leo. Even Leo. Ha! No way! Ha! We got, can we climb up here, do you think? Can I jump? Man. Oh, but maybe this will lead us. We can get onto here, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. You found a peanut! A single peanut! Someone dropped a peanut! Nice find! Maybe you should hold on to it in case you feel weak later, but don't get too full of plate more food where we're headed. I can almost smell it. Items can be equipped. Once a food item has been equipped, it can be used in every battle. In every- what? Once- Five seeds in wallet. I love that. I love this. This is so cute. Oh, that's a skill tree! This guy's already level- Oh, what? Dude, Lance is so cool. Ah, and we can respec whenever we want? Lance gets five seeds when he wins a battle. That's what we want. Respec whenever we want. That's awesome. This guy hasn't put his things in. What do you need? Is it is it stars? Ah, yeah, it's a star. 
So if we go back here, that's how many stars you have. And this kid has none. Okay. But equip. Let's equip to... To Verm. Heals five. I think maybe it means that once you've equipped it, we can use it once in battle, right? But using a peanut as a health potion is so cute. You're like so used to having these magical powers and stuff, but oh no. But look, just look at what we've got equipped right now. We've just got a little thing. Oh, a perfect training. Tin sword, cotton cloak, musk bow. Oh no, gangsters. Rat gangsters. Not enough step, you two. Or else you have to face the combined wrath of Bree and... Hey, our boy. We've got company. Get with the program. Stilton! Oh, he made him drop his chalk. Not another step, you two. Or else you'll have to... Yeah, we've done that part already. Rest assured, sirs, we'll make no trouble. My brother and I are just passing through. Ain't that easy. This is a troll road, you see. Don't you mean a toll road? A little bit of both, to be perfectly honest with you. Yeah, all rats sound like that. They all sound like grizzled Englishmen. It's ten seeds each to pass. No way. We're not paying you flea bit and losers diddly squat. You tell him, Verm. Not now, now, Verm. Let's show some decorum. Sirs, I'm afraid my brother and I have no seeds on our pers persons. Perhaps you'll be so kind as to let us through anyway. No seeds, sir. Do you smell that still? Then? I think I do, Bree. It's the smell of a liar. Let's gut these two and scrounge the seeds from their corpses. Oh shit, you shouldn't have done that. Whoa! Whoa, yeah, that looks good. Just remember your training, Verm. Attack them until they fall down. Exactly, yeah. Music is good. Right, attack. We've only got swipe attack. We'll fight... I think we attack Stilton first. He feels, he seems like the, uh, the the fast one, you know, with less health. Quick shot or mega shot? Let's go for a mega shot. Try and see if we can finish them early. Ooh. Yeah, he's got like a charge attack. We're gonna keep attacking this guy. So you only recover, you recover one diamond, one action point, let's say, per turn. But you can only, so you only cover with one, but using a mega shot uses two. So once we do this, we're going to be stuck using quick shots unless we like defend for a turn. That's an interesting mechanic already. There you go. There you go. So this is, this is what I'm talking about with, RP, with JRPGs and stuff. A lot of the time it's just so standard. Just, oh yeah, just attack, just attack, just attack. I, I, I really dislike that. You know, I mean, I don't want to like... Use Pokemon as the most obvious obvious one, because Pokemon is kind of garbage, everybody knows that. Like, the, the combat in Pokemon isn't anything special, is it? it? You can tap A to the end of that game. You can tap basic attack until the end of, you know, the universe in that game. Got you, losers. Yeah! You little runts! Chief Sapper will have your heads for this. Yeah, Sapper the Slayer will chop you in a mouse, mate! Get out of here. Sava the Slayer? Maybe the tale is true. What tale? Word in the tunnels is that a waterfall fell into the Under River four seasons ago. He grew fat on water waste. Uh, so fat that the Under River rats started worshipping him as a chieftain. Some say he's as big as a horse and that he swings around god weapons like they're nothing. I think they're calling humans god, right? They're, they're calling god weapons and god, god meals, god food. That can't be true. No rodent can grow that big, right? I say. I always thought it was a myth, just like ghosts and muss wolves. Right, just ghosts and muss wolves. Go find out. Oh no, I chopped my mice up. <laughs> the S! It's here! The S! Yes, screenshot. Perfect. The perfect S. Brilliant. Ooh! Look, Verm, it's a shrine to your hero. Whoa, Blade Master Leo! What is, what's the statue doing down here? Perhaps the under of a scoundrel's billet. Even they know to respect the powers of the crown. No way, they must have looted it. I guess that's more likely. In any case, we should say a quick prayer for protection. Mouse warrior pro tip, save your game, say a prayer at a statue. Smart warriors pray regularly. 
I like that this has got little tea lights as well. A copper statue of a field mouse wielding a needle-like rapier. It might just be a needle. The plaque reads, In honor of Blade Master Leo, slayer of Iron Fang the Vulps, savior of Sol Hill Village, and hero to all. Blade Master Leo stands proud, save your game. Alright. No, no, no. We're done. Go back down here. Cross. Under you. And we're off. Oh no, it's these two doofuses again. Oh no, it's there. Hi hey, Chief, they're here! A freaking wombat? Two mice! <laughs> that's his that's his voice. Rats, I can understand, but you're telling me you had your asses kicked by two whittled mice. <laughs> Don't underestimate them, Chief. The bigger one's a scary good shot with a bow. And the little one's got some fancy sword work going on. Pathetic, <laughs> they're both. Yeah, I'll deal with these ones myself. He's got a he's got a Swiss army knife. Chief Saver, I presume. It's a pleasure to meet you in person. What a letdown. You said he was as big as a horse, Lance. Fur, uh, mind your manners. <laughs> ah! Quite a smart tongue you got there, little one. I bet it won't be so smart when I cut it from your mouth. <laughs> Ooh, so it's true you do possess a god weapon. <laughs> Say hello to the Titan Reaper. <laughs> this butte can cut through all creatures, great and small. Mice and rats, fish and felonies. Um, I even brought down a Nightwing one time. Lance, what do we do? Keep your nerve firm. The Vol talks big and carries an impressive weapon. But I wonder, can he even swing something so unwieldy? Can I, Ek? I'm gonna carve your blight buffs here. <laughs> Oh, it's go time. It's go time, mofo. We've healed up, because I guess because we saved. Ooh, big damage. Big damage. Um, yeah, well, obviously we're gonna keep using Mega Shot until we can't anymore. Nine. Come at me, you flea ben, yellow bellied losers. Don't take the bait, Verm. So if I use this, no, I'll no, just defend right now. Yeah, 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 don't take the bait, don't take the bait. We just defend up. He's gonna parry. Ha! You're no fun. And then we swipe him. And we've managed to recover another diamond, another action point to do another mega shot, which is nice. Yeah! Sweet. I'm gonna use a peanut. A peanut. It's so cute. Um, I'll attack you with a quick shot until you start going to parry mode again. Go on, hit me, see what happens. Nope. It looks freaking amazing. It looks super cute. There you go. You're no fun. Right, you're about to die. Get mega shot, you little bish. Yeah! Oh my god, he didn't die. I'm worried. He's gonna now he's gonna do his parry thing again. Oh he's dead! Get out of here! Level up! Uh Savas down, no oh, no. Let's get out of here. Look at him covered in arrows, it's brutal. Get back here, you damn disloyal gutter rats. You've lost a lot of blood, Chief. Make your peace with the world. Oh, I've long made my peace. Very well, and this is where we part ways. Come along, Verm. Hey, you're going up to heaven, aren't you? Heaven? The god's food hall just above here. We are. Then from one foul verming to another, don't bother. That place used to be paradise, but now the yellow god roams the hall. The cat. All that awaits you is death. We fall into the sewer. Oh, no. That was gross. Farewell, Chief. May your soul pass to the next world unhindered. Lance, what's a yellow god? Why is this Lance guy the fucking coolest? Just the coolest. Just like... Just this... Crazy battle, right? Pushes me to the edge. Pushes us both to the edge of, of death. 
and then he's just like so long chief you know and it, it, godspeed he's just like the coolest motherfucker i've ever seen and he's dressed like robin hood what's a yellow god that's a new one to me but don't let it bug you verm in all my travels i've never seen or heard of any deadly yellow god it's the crazy mutterings of a dying rodent just go to muss wolves <clears throat> right just go some muss wolves let's keep moving we're almost at the hard Burn, what are you doing? Look at this thing, it's amazing. It's so big. It's quite a weapon. I'm taking it with me. Forget it, Firm. Getting food is much higher priority than collecting some fancy god relic. Yeah, I guess you're right. Do you think a mouse could ever use a weapon like this? Maybe the strongest mouse in the world. Or the craziest. Come on, we have a mission. Heaven. <laughs> Feeling stronger, you might have just leveled up. Again, the skill. Yep, yep, yep. We're going to be doing that for sure. Treasure map. Trinkets. You have to find it first. My treasure is yours. How do I use it? Okay. Skills. So you. This thing. This is, I mean, this increases health. I kind of want this because I want more money to be able to buy more things. Right? Seeds is seeds are money, and we only have five. So getting five at a time seems like quite a lot. You can always respec anyway. You don't really have a choice for a couple of turns. You're going to have to just increase that a little bit. Trinkets, however. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. It just... C opens the menu. But it does nothing inside the menu. Yeah, you also... So I can't use this trinket. And I, I can't equip it. You can use the peanut each turn. Each battle. It doesn't get used up. Okay. So it's like a... a a permanent item. Okay, that's awesome. This is it. Brace yourself, Verm. Um. Solid pistachio nuts. Organic sunflower seeds. We're in a shopping... Oh my god, this game looks so freaking good. Heinz beans. Beans means Heinz. Where was this made? This has to be like Australian or English or something because it has heat. Heinz beans. I mean, I know it says hands peas, but it's clearly... It even has the 99. The yellow god, the cat, right? Whoa! Beautiful, isn't it? Fruit, grain, meat, items I can't even describe, all neatly wrapped and ours for the taking. But we mustn't dawdle. Dad's letter says that the horde is overrun with hungry gods at dawn. <laughs> so, yeah, the humans are the gods. What do we start with? Yeah. Corn, let's find some corn. And bananas and bread. This is that chocolate I smell? Calm down, Verm. It's seeds we want. Seeds? How boring. Boring, yes, but they're valuable and imperishable. This guy's just the best. Lead the way, and I think they're stored at the end of this corridor. Oh my god, we get to walk around this place? Oh, so cool. The 3D... Potatoes. Don't get distracted, Verm. Focus on the mission. Oh, Warhol's classic. <laughs> That's great. Enchilada set, old Toby. Ziggy's Bolognese. This is Hilda Rice. Ooh, woo. I hate you. They did that on purpose. The ooh, woo is there. Okay. I gotta follow. I'm gonna be following these developers. Pompey chopped tomatoes. Following these on Twitter. These guys are a good laugh. What? Oh, green gnome. Green giant. I've seen those before. They're sinister contraptions. One wrong step and bam. The bar comes down and snaps your neck in two. Dad called them thunder snares. You serious? They look so harmless. Don't even touch them. Let's tread lightly. Yeah. We're through the middle of... Green giant. Lance, who made the thunder snare things? Gods? Indeed. And they were probably left out as a warning. Warning for us. We're trespassing on holy ground after all. Are you scared? A little. Me too. But we have each other's backs. That's what family's for, right? Yep, we stick together. These guys are the greatest. If if my if my brother dies, if any of these rat mice die, I'm I'm I, I'm I'm going to scream. I'm going to I don't know what I'll do. They, they're just so awesome. They can't they can't be leading me up to a death here. It feels like they are, though, somehow. They're making them way too amazing. Nuts. Yes, nuts. Oh, wait, I can look at the items. Oh, man. 
I know this one. It's corn. Corn Vern. I know. Corn. Corn Vern. What's down there? It smells weird. No seeds, that's for sure. Come on, Vern, we're close. Should have been reading all these. This is what we want. There are enough seeds in one packet to feed the, feed the village for a month. Help me drag it down. It's huge. How are we going to get it back past the thunder snares? We'll solve the problem when we get there. For now, just help me drag it towards the under river. I'll pull. You go around the other side and push. Are you ready? Let's do this. That's the spirit. All right, when I give the signal, give the packet a big shove to the left. I'm having to like time it with his arrow keys. There's gonna when it when we go past here. You smell something? You and your nose. Try to focus firm. When we move past here, there's gonna be a cat waiting for us, and it's going to kill Lance, and I'm going to cry. All right, it's gonna be right there. It's gonna see us in the open when we go past. I know it is. I know it's coming. It smells sweet. Not good sweet though. I'm getting with too. It's sickly. It's not poison, is it? We stick to the mission on my mark. It's poison! No! No! Lance, I feel dizzy. Oh dear, can we keep, can you keep going? I think something that smells really strong. I think it's coming from... The yellow god. Is... Is that... Behind the back now! He's gonna, he's gonna have a hazmat suit on. Yeah! Oh no! Did he see us? We need to get out of here now! What about the seeds? Forget the seeds, run! Be careful with the traps, be careful with the traps. Oh. Oh! No! No! No, no, no! No, no, no! No, no, no! No, no! Oh! His tail's caught. Ah! He's gonna have to cut his tail off. No, Verm, no! Lance, it hurts. Hold on, don't move. All right, stay calm. It's just your tail, thank the fates. We can get you out of this, right. Here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna lift the bar and you're gonna squeeze out. Squeeze out, I know you can do it. When I give the signal, just push as hard as you can on my mag. Cut the tail off, 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 no! Dude, no, are you pulling? Yes! Let's try again, all oh, you might now. No, no, no! No. This isn't working. Cut the tail off. Cut the tail off. And we're running out of time. I'll stall the god. You find a way to get yourself free. Lance, no, 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 Lance, no! Cut. Don't go, I'm scared. Over here, you monster. Oh, no. Damn it all. Hey, you over here, look at me. I said, look at me, come on. <gasps> I had got its attention. Defend. Five. No! No! Dude, no! I fucking knew you were gonna do that. Why? I've got to escape. His tail, he's gonna cut his tail off. Lance! Lance needs my help.
Kill me. Run, mouse, run. Sorry for the flashing light, that's not, that's not my fault, it's the game. We're in London. Oh, that fucking sucked. I'm like in tears. Like legit. You fuckers. I knew they were going to do that and you still got me. Bastards. You got the, you got the fucking thing. You got the thing. Verm learned rage. He brought the, the weapon home. What level is he now? You should not have come here, mouse. I'm passing through to Crane Bale. Let me be and I will make no trouble. Oh, you found trouble, friend. Tiger, I am the predator and you are the prey. And you run and I chase. That is the way of nature. Yeah. Not this time, pal. Who said anything about running? What's this? A mouse wielding a god weapon. Now I've seen it all. Very well, show me your strength, amuse me. Go berserk for three turns. You're no predator, you're nothing but an overfed fuzzball. Bold words for a morning snack. The eyes. Impressive, but it takes more than that to hurt a tiger. All right, a little mole wizard. Whoa, is that a mouse? A mouse knight fighting tiger? We got knocked out. The sword is as, as heavy as anything. How did the Mouse Knight even swing it? Ow. Oh, Grand, you're not dead. I never remember how, how, how to say this name. Shabon. Shabon. Steady on your feet now. Are you hurt? Don't touch that. <laughs> I'm fine. Whoa, he's the real deal. Pardon? I saw you going paw to claw against Tiger. Blow for blow. It was the coolest thing I've ever seen. It was amazing. Well, until he sent you flying, that is. I had to drag you here before he gobbled you up. It was a close call. You dragged me here? Where is here exactly? All right, hold on. Crane Bale. Their burrows are deep, their convictions deeper. <laughs> Grand Bale. Is this, this is Grand Bale the Sanctuary of Knowledge? 
It is welcome, welcome. I'm Shab Shaban, daughter of Lady Gilda. She's the head of the village. You should come meet her. Mammy doesn't normally like visitors, but you're something special. Fine, fine. I have a question for her anyway. Lead the way. Can I go around and talk to people? The old tiger's right, piece of work. Can't be doing anything when he's on the prowl. Welcome, an outsider. Welcome to Tullia's. Take a gander of what's in stock. So what it'll what'll it be? Armor. The armor strong enough to withstand blows from titans and gods. I see a full suit of plate armor. It is then sure, but I'll sell for chainmail. Bella, look around yourself. This shop sells bits and bobs for the humble people of Cranbale. Cooking wear, mining equipment, linens and such. This isn't a royal armory, yeejit. Yeejit. Well, do you have anything I can use? I can do you a pair of high quality mole made boots. Good for hiking and mining, only five seeds. What do you say, five seeds for the boots? Deal. Sounds good, I'll take them. Tried to stay off mischief. Village has seen enough adventure. Plus four. Oh, it only goes up by one, though. Obviously, I don't need weapon. Yeah, because I've got I've got my god weapon. I guess we never need a new weapon, right? Isn't like this the point? I wonder if we're gonna get even better bigger things. Oh, it's another statue to, to pray at. The crown is happy to take our seeds for taxes, but where's their support when we need it, eh? Oh, I feel you, brother. I can't play. My mom says it's not safe outside. Library. Nerds. Dear Ruth, I hope all's well at the nook. I wanted to pay a visit for Young King's cor coronation. But alas, Cranbale needs its librarian. Let's see, and here. No. The books in this case are old and tired. You try reading, the pages crumble between your fingers. Been written in illuminated mole script. They're beautiful, but you cannot understand the writing. You see a gold trimmed book title, of Fables of Hussan. Read it. Put it back. Read it. The young viper found herself stranded on the bank of a great river after slivering for a while she encountered a raven. I would be most grateful, said the viper, if you would fly me across the water. The raven squinted at the fanged worm before him. You're not going to bite me, are you? I wouldn't dream of such a thing. The viper replied, her forked tongue flicked back and forth. It's the scorpion and the toad. Adjust his bet against his better judgment, the raven, ag raven agreed. He picked up the viper in his talon, spread his wings and flew skyward. Soon enough, the two landed on the other side of the river, safe in hand. The viper bowed in thanks. Hold up, said the raven. Why didn't you bite me? You had every opportunity. Isn't biting in your nature? The viper smiled. In all things of nature, there is something of the marvellous. Alright, it was a nice take on the scorpion. Wholesome mouse recipes by Jan Olive. This is going to be how you cook my mice. Oh, it serves four or just one really hungry mice? Acorn, cup of flour, paw of mashed banana, ground seed, a sprinkle of cinnamon, mix ingredients, spread over a baking coin. Cook over a candle flame for three minutes or until firm. Eat one more cool. The Pact of Five. Following the massacre of the Eastern Maya, Emperor Marcus wrote the Pact of Five. This legal document granted Rodinshian citizenship to five key species. Rats, moles, mice, shrews, and squirrels. Carnivores were explicitly excluded. Even now, long after the fall of the Shrew Empire and the rise of the Rat Monarchy, the Pact is held as uh, sacrosanct. Formed forming the basis of modern Rod Rodin Rodentian law. You see a book titled The Old Way. To follow the path of the old way, thou must abide by three laws. Thou shalt not harm a god. Thou shalt avoid the god's gaze. Thou shalt not toy with a god's tools. Obey these laws and Rodent, um, and God may live peacefully side by side as they have done for thousands of years. Disobey these laws and the gods will punish us with fire and suffering. You see a book titled The Rights of Masters. As a personal bodyguard to lords, ladies, kings, and queens, blade masters are required to be loyal, chivalrous, and of course, exceptional in combat. In contrast, the law master serves their liege by offering wisdom gained by offering wisdom uh, by offering wisdom gained from two whole seasons of study at a licensed university. Larger cities offer and employ a variety of other masters to serve as advisors. Plague masters oversee the health of a colony. Seed masters manage the city's treasury. Build masters specialize in urban planning. Of course, all this is 
All this fine counsel is irrelevant if a liege refuses to listen, as is often the case. Tin statue of Maul dressed in humble robes. A rodent's life is short, a written story is eternal. I don't want to overwrite my brother. A split. A yo yo vehicle weapon. You look like a sturdy lad. You're a warrior, are you not? A fork's not as good as a as a as a knife like this, though. Because a fork's like normal ways. This is like a special thing, and it's a blade. It's like a big sword. You look like a sturdy lad. You're a warrior. I am. I knew it. You have those warrior eyes. I was a fighter in my youth too. I'll have you know. A member of Murida's. Uh, I'm sure you were. Ha! Don't give me lip, lad. I may be past my prime, but I've had more fights than you've had dinners. I've got years of battle-tested wisdom to offer, do tell. Go on then, what's the key? Weaknesses. Everyone has a weakness. If you use the right type of attack, you can exploit it. The right type of attack. Ah, you really are young. Let's see, how can I put this? There are four kinds. You've got your slashing attacks, swords and such. Your bashing attacks, hammers and blunt instruments. Spears and pikes give you piercing. And the fourth kind is... Fire. Is, uh... Special attacks like fire or water or whatever. You're making this up as you go, aren't you? Oh, shut your bake. This system's famous. Everyone has a weakness. Find it and exploit it. What about cats? The weakness of a felidae. Ah, you're talking about tiger. Wish I knew. See mole warriors slash, bash, and stab that kitty, but his fur is just too damn thick. If someone wanted to take that monster, monster down, they would have to do something truly special. Hmm. Hmm. This is the council room. Ready to go in? Oh, I'm ready. It's a freaking hedgehog. Shaban, um, shouldn't you be studying? Who's the outsider? Oh, yes, introductions. That's Lawmaster Morvin on the left. Blade Master Nemain, the hedge knight on the right. And Mammy, I mean Lady Gilda of Cranbale in the middle. Mammy, this is... I didn't get your name. Um... Right, Sir Verm. Sir? I'm not the knight. Really? Huh? Anyway, Mammy, I saw this guy fighting Tiger. He was swinging around a god weapon like nobody's business. That stupid cat had no idea what he's dealing with. I think this guy might actually be able to... Calm yourself, young lady. Sorry, Mammy. Mouse, you fought the felly deer with a god weapon? Um, I apologize. I apologize if I've broken your customs. I, I read it in the book. No offense was intended. Your intentions are moot. To fight a god's pet with a god's weapon, this is sacrilege, sacrilege of the worst kind. In accordance with the laws of the old way, punishment is in order, my lady. Want me to put him in the stockade? Try it, Pinecorn, see what happens. <laughs> Quiet, everyone. This mouse is a visitor. He's not bound by our local customs. We won't punish you, mouse, but you, we won't help you either. Do whatever it is you came to do and then take your leave. Fine, I don't plan on sticking around anyway. Before I go, I need some information. I'm looking for the... One known as the Yellow God. Hello, God. I'm afraid we don't know any gods on a first name basis around here, except for Cormac, I suppose. Have you heard of this Yellow God, Lawmaster Morvin? I'm afraid not, my lady. Perhaps this mouse should head to Morida. One million mice and rats live there. Nobles, merchants, academics. I'm sure one of them can be of assistance. That was going to be my next destination anyway. Very well, take your leave, mouse. Ah, so Verm went up. Shaban, may I have a word? Mingling with blaspheming vagabonds is the most unbecoming of a young lady. Stop calling me young lady, you know I hate it. This writing is really good as well. Young lady, you are nobility. Know your place and return to your studies. Studies? Mammy, that filly is killing all us off one by one and you aren't doing anything to stop it. Not another word. What would your father have said if he saw you mingling with a vagabond? Well, Dar's not here, is he? Shaban! That rock headed child. He thinks herself a warrior, a father's daughter, alright. Hold your tongue, Blade Master. Yes, my lady. Sorry, my lady. Let me guess, your mum told you off for hanging around with strangers? Whoa, look at the eyes! Wait, are you crying? Oh no. No. Nothing to be ashamed about. Mum is so damn stuck up. 
Ever since Dad died, she's been obsessed with following the old way to the letter. No God tools, no God interference at all, but what good's that doing us? How does co cowering in a burrow help anyone when Tiger's on the prowl? I get it. Most rodents would rather hide away than face real issues head on. But you seem like a smart kid. I'm sure you'll make it through this. Wait. Before you go, can I show you something? It'll only take a minute. One minute? Just something in the library. Lead the way. Shaban's gonna come with us, man. 100%. We're gonna, we're gonna run away from royalty. How are you behaving yourself, Shaban? I am anti energin of course. Mm-hmm. Shouldn't you be studying? I should, but I was just going to show the visit the illuminated manuscripts in the back. Mm-hmm. Stay out of trouble, young lady. Your mother worries about you. I know. Illuminated manuscripts. Just follow me. We already looked at them, but we couldn't read them. I'm not interested in some old books. Never mind the books. I've got something better. I knew it. Right behind here. You can't tell anyone about this. Especially not Mammy. Sure, whatever. I'm serious. Promise me. All right, all right. I promise. Of course, of course. Give me myself. Come on. God things. A treasure trove, huh? Yep, God tools. Been secretly collecting and studying for a whole season now. Game dude. You see this? It's a God's timekeeper. I can't read the runes yet, but I'm getting there. This machine's a fancy God's toy, I think. I watched a young one play with it for hours. It turns on, but the screen's all banjaxed, so I reckon it's missing a part. This is all fascinating, truly, but if you brought me down, just show me your trinket collection. Wait, wait, you'll really like this next one. It's a lighter. Do you know what this is? I've seen them around. Another common god tool. Even better, a god weapon like yours. I've got it working. Even spruced it up to pack a proper punch. But it's in need of a field test. I thought I could use it on Tiger. Give him what for? Maybe save the village? But I don't think I can. Not because I'm scared. I mean, I am scared, of course, but... Get it. You do? You want to take that Philidae down, but you know attacking Tiger yourself would be suicide. The other moles in this village just sit on their tails and rant about the old way. So you want me to lend my sword? Right, pretty much. Could you? Sorry to disappoint, I don't do sell sword work. Sell sword work? I couldn't pay you if I wanted to. The village's flower broke. I was hoping you'd do it, you know? Because you're a chivalrous knight. Like I said, I'm not a knight. I didn't come here to do charity work. So go rally the thimble guard or something. I'm out. Ah! I'm not running away. So, Verm, are you okay? You're really pitiful, you know that? Yeah, I know. It's like his brother's in his head. I'll help you. Really? Yeah. We'll go kill that filly day. You can reap the glory or restore your village honor or whatever. Just make sure to follow my orders. Yes, sir, Verm, to the letter. I'll go wait by the lift. It is a lighter, right? Thank you so much, sir, Verm. The only way to kill a cat. Set it on fire. Siobhan has joined the party. Well, at least if it all goes wrong, she'll make for a good distraction. Cool. Maybe I should... I'm like, I'm like, maybe we should hide this before we go. When we come back down here, they're gonna have found this, obviously. Oh, you know what we should save before we go? Because, uh, good nights save regularly or whatever. Return to the surface. It's freaking go time with his cat. We're gonna singe its fur off and it's gonna you know, run away and never come back. What? What is this thing? It's creepy looking. Even my statue standards. It's Cormax, the village's watchful protector. Oh, not doing a very good job, is he? I guess it's not. Cormac, the watchful stairs. Oh, he's a safe point as well. What about down here? Is there anywhere we can explore? The game doesn't have much exploration. It's very, like, story-based. You know, we don't really go around into, into like, a dungeon or anything. It's just following the story, which is interesting. I like that. The warrior mouse returns with a ball this time. Don't tell me the little kid is scared of being outnumbered. Scared? All I see before me are an entree and a main course. Go ahead, mouse and mole. Use your god weapons. They won't save you. 
It is a layer, yeah. That's easy to see from there. Hold your nerve, mole. Hold my nerve. I'm done holding my nerve. I'm gonna unleash fire and fury. Rage. Light him up, Shabon. I'm on it. Worm fire. Yeah, super 13 damage. Ooh. Worm fire again. Ooh. Right. Last berserk. Yep. You're gonna defend. Uh oh. You're gonna use a peanut on this guy. And then we can worm fire again twice. No, no, just once, just once. Super. One on me. I am going to rage. I would like to rage. Light him up, Shaban. I'm on it. Defend. With you, we're gonna swipe. Let's go, baby. 12 damage. Worm fire. Yeah! Get burnt, kitty. Nice. Yeah, come after me. I don't care. Oh! Get bent. Level up. Verm learned cleave. We did it! We actually did it! But we didn't land a killing blow. Doesn't matter. Kitten won't be bothering the village anytime soon. Come on, let's give Mother the good news. You're gonna get in so much fucking trouble. <laughs> oh no, you're gonna get in so much trouble. As soon as we get down there, we're gonna be like, arrested. And they're gonna have found all of your god's ghouls. I know it. I know it for a fact. <laughs> Or not. Why are you still here, Vagabond? I thought I made myself clear. Mommy, you'll never guess what. Sir Verm and I fought off Tiger. We actually did it. You slayed the Philidae? Well, we didn't quite slay it, but we certainly sent him running. That mangy monster will be licking his wounds for seasons. My word, Shaban. I knew you were no dainty lady, but this is something else. Don't you have anything to say, Mammy? I do. You disappoint me, Shaban. I disappoint you. I've freed us from Tiger's tyranny. You short-sighted fool of a daughter. What will happen if the gods see us as a threat? Blades and poison, fire and water. They would rain hell on us. And it would be the end of Cranbale. Mammy, get out. Fine. Come on, Verm. I'll see you to the entrance. No, Shaban. Leave. You want to be a warrior so much like your father was? You want to tinker with god tools and fight titans? Well, fine, you've got your wish. I'm exiling you from Cranbale Village. Mommy, go on, leave, don't come back. Verm, wasn't it? You've caused enough damage here, I think. Whatever. You know, I came here because I heard Cranbale was the gathering place of the smartest minds in Roden Rodentia. All I found are stubborn idiots. Do you want to follow the old way or do you want to survive? The old way is survival. The old way is dead. Shaban gets that. Why can't you? Get out! Yeah, get shut up. Is that too harsh on Shaban, Lawmaster? A harsh lesson is sometimes needed, my lady. Perhaps if it would ease my lady's worries, I could send a butterfly. A butterfly? To the king, a formal request to watch the girl should she enter Morita. Very well. That's how they send messages on butterflies. Yes, yes, yes. Now we've got two. Where is she? She's gonna be in, in with all the stuff. Or is she just outside? Van said this thing was missing a part. Vice looks complicated, but none of these buttons do anything. The runes are strange. You cannot read godly writing. Turn to the surface. Okay, this game's actually insanely good. It's so sick. Oh, the crying, it's so sad. Oh, there you are. 
What, what am I supposed to do now? Anything you want. Can I come with you? Anything but that. I've got a job to do. They say two people shot on the road. Don't follow me. I said don't follow me. You're a liability. Was I a liability against Tiger? You were okay. <laughs> Just okay. But you're going to Merida, right? I can help you get there. I don't need a chaperone. So, Verm, I know I'm not the greatest fighter. And I don't know what this yellow god is you're after, but I want to learn and I want to help. What do you say? Fine. We'll go to Merida together. After that, who knows? Thank you, Sir Verm. I won't let you down. Don't be the end. I want to play more. Ooh, chest up there somehow. It's a road. It's a back. Look, Sir Verm. Godly junk. Let's move on. Godly junk. What's this? Just garbage. Come on, we've got a lot of walking to do. Uh. Is there someone out there? Yeah. Ah, cool. Uh, mind helping me out? I'm a bit stuck. He's stuck in the wheelie bin. So, Verm, we have to help them. We're never going to make it to Merida if we get sidetracked by every idiot in distress. Oi! You're headed to Merida? I could fly you there. Fly? Of course, that's a carrier basket over there. This person must be a majestic carrier raven. So, Verm, this is a golden opportunity, a free ticket to Merida. A direct flight would save a lot of time. Weeks, even. All right, sit tight, bird. Cool beans, I'm not going anywhere. I can, oh my god, we can jump. We've learned how to jump. First, we're going to go get this chest, obviously. You think I didn't see it? Five seeds, that's not so bad. You know what? We actually didn't use our stars, so you need extra defense. And you, ooh, you can be, you, you're opened up quite right away. Defending recovers one? Wow. Wow, so when I def that's amazing. We're gonna use that. When I defend, it means I can use my fire again right away, like twice. That's pretty awesome. Yeah. That's gonna be really good. Gonna allow us to, to use fire whip like way more often. One and a half times as often. We do need extra life, for sure, but that's going to have to be secondary. Bending heals three. Fire attacks deal increase max damage if you're at max thing, okay. The star ones are the important ones, right? Shaban goes berserk if an ally falls in battle. Shaban starts battle with one overclock charge. What's this one? Increase max by one. Ooh. Items used by Shaban are slightly more effective, okay. I don't really have a choice with you, which is a problem. But this one is while in Berserk State, Verm heals two at the start of each turn. Pretty awesome. Rage grants an additional turn of Berserk. Cleave inflicts three bleed. Um, Cleave inflicts power break for one turn. Verm attacks deal increased damage to Titans and Gods. A successful dodge recovers one. Dude, what? We're going to be actually straight fighting Titans and Gods then? Is this weird? This is going to be insane. This lid looks pretty heavy. Will I be able to lift it? Guess I won't know until I try. I, I need to show Sir Verm that I'm not a liability. There must be some way I can help. Looks a bit like Tiger. Verm's busy up there. Should I look around here? Maybe the backpack. The backpack for sure. I knew it. There's all kinds of good grand things in here. There's pointy sticks, a rubbery cube. A rubber a cube? It's supposed to be a fidget cube. Root strength didn't work. Maybe I can stab this damn lid open. So, Verm, I found something. Junk. Not just any old junk. Give me a second. Oh my god, this is this this girl's awesome. A ruler. You built a seesaw? A lever! It's basic mechanics! If we both jump as hard as we can on that end, the lid will go flying. Will it really? Trust me. Are you ready, bird? Ready for what now? They're ready. Fine, let's give this a shot on three. One, two. Pfft. 
<laughs> the pigeon. Oh my days, dizzy. I almost died in there. I have no idea how YouTube busts me out, but mad respect. How did you even get stuck in the first place? Uh, so, like, you know that thing where you smell a bit of food and you follow it, and the next thing you know, you're stuck in a box surrounded by garbage. Yeah. Oh yeah, the name's Dizzy, by the way. A pleasure to meet you, Dizzy. I'm Lady Shaban, and this is Sir Verm. Again, I'm not a knight. You says you two were headed to Murray to the road and capital, right? Journey's a breeze. Just a short flight west of here. You've got to, you've got to nod your head. And the, with the bird. I can take you right away. Are you sure? So kind of you. The least I can do for getting me out of that thing. Open the basket when you're ready. We're ready. Unless I can go find more stuff in here. Giving use after all. We're off to the road in capital. Hold on tight, because I ain't stopping if you fall. There's a fucking overworld map where you're flying a pigeon around in a basket. This game is too good. Jesus. This game is so good, man. And it's obviously London. Look, you can see the river passing right through it. It's awesome. Oh, well, there you well, if you needed more confirmation. Jesus. Looks like the new version of Big Ben as well, where it's all gold. This station is Merida. Had a good flight? Yeah, pretty smooth. What did you think, Shaban? Blah. Ah, she's gone. Yeah, moles ain't built for flying. Anyways, Merida's threw a gutter over there. Take you to a pipe that goes down, way down, to the under river level. So Merida lies below us. Just what kind of fancy god building is this place anyway? Beats me, mouse can't use those pigeons. Just call it the Belfry. The gods call it the Western Palace. It's just some old building they use for bureaucratic work. True. But we we won't see any godly business because Merida lies below the floorboard. The run city and the godly city. Two societies that are so close but never overlap. Guess you're feeling better. Oh, I suppose I am. Thank you for the trip, Mr. Dizzy. No probs. You two got me out of a real pickle. So feel free to stop by if you need to go somewhere else. Uh oh, fight on the bridge. Always fight on the bridge. The Under River. This must be Bloody Bridge. It connects the city's east gate. And the rapid water below is the moat of Merida. The current is the moat. Uh, in the moat is so intense that anyone who falls in is swept straight out to sea. You should know a lot about Random Bridge. It's a famous bridge, so um, wars have been decided on this very choke point. Fascinating. I see the gate ahead. <laughs> These characters, the writing is so good, man. I just can't get over it. It's so good. The copper doors of Murida's East Gate. The famous city beneath the city is just beyond here. Stay your business, Thomas. Our business is our own, nosy. So <laughs> that be nice. The verification of all migrants and visitors is standard Murida procedure. I apologize for my companion. He's just a, cr a little cranky from the long journey. I am not cranky. Ahem. Stay your business. Right, our business. We are... Merchants? We sell fruits and nuts from the Great West. Oh yeah, where are your wares? Uh, pa! Some merchants you are. Clearly just a pair of fibbing vagabonds. On the King's Order, Merida's border is closed. There's no admissance, especially for back vagabonds like yourself. Good day! Can you maybe make an excel? Oh, he's gone. We, we, maybe we shouldn't have lied. You two over here. I think I'm leaving before I get this chest. Three seeds, baby. Is that 13 now or just eight? Yeah. Whoa! The wee bookkeeper didn't let you pass, eh? Uh, that's right. Um, right. Nimati. There's another route. I can't do a Scottish accent. I'm just reading it out. I'm sorry. <laughs> See, this is a service tunnel that goes to Merida. It's a labyrinth, and I know the way. 
So you'll be our guide, that's great. What's your price, Harlequin? Price? I'm no fool, you want seeds, right? Nah, I didn't want your seeds, just your skills. Our skills? You warriors, eh? Sometimes there's a few wee bugs on the path, I reckon we could bash them silly. It's just a few wee bugs, why don't you fight them yourself? I'm a bard, not a fighter. We've got a fucking squirrel bard on his team. Ow! This game is the best. A lousy pacifist. I think that's a very fair offer, Mr. Squirrel. What do you say, Savum? Deal. Boy, bugs are pushovers. I say we have a deal, Squirrel. Magic. Name's Bruce, by the way. Um, and I'm Lady Shaban. No, wait, just Shaban. Nice to meet you, Bruce. Pleasure to meet both. Yeah, and meet you both. Uh, let's not waste any more time. <clears throat> He's got a pencil. His weapon is a pencil. He's turned into a flute. He's turned it into a flute. He's turned it into a flute. It's got holes in it. He's turned a pencil into a flute. Guys, he's turned a pencil into a flute. Warning, the service tunnel is for authorized personnel only. You know, it's been an hour. We should probably stop playing this game. But I'll be damned if you can drag me away from this. Uh, we're going to play it till the freaking end. He's playing it like a flute. It's so good. It's so good. Refuses to take it off. You can't take the mask off. We've got a cape instead of the hat. Yep. Didn't think about that. But is she going to wear it? No, she doesn't wear it, though. Right, you've got one extra start. You're level four. Okay, so healing melodies. This one is cause cures status ailments, and this one is recover one on taking damage. Let's do that. Let's do that. And um, if we're going to be healing, let's increase this by one. Oh, we, oh yeah, 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 yeah. The next. So we've got two health. We've increased this by one. We need to go... Let's go into battle first and see what you can even do. I'm assuming it's a single heal. If it was a group heal. Oh, I almost forgot. Don't even think of using the service tunnel because one of our engineers was eaten by a... Oh, they're gone. Well, not my fleas, not my circus. Dishbag. It's a copper statue of a shrew holding a scroll. The plaque reads, Beauty can be found in all things. Build master Vishruvius, first architect of Merida. Vishruvius plans ahead. Save your game. The trio. Your game has been saved. The labyrinth. What denizens lurk within. Please let me just at least see one fight with a bug. Don't enter the demo right here. We've got a problem. Our route goes via this tunnel. It's all clogged with fat and gun canoe knows what. So we dig. You're welcome to get your hands dirty, lad. I ain't touching that foul blob. I got a better idea. Under river pipe, right? There must be a way to control the water flow. We can increase the pressure of block. Blockage will pop right out. You're a smart one, ain't you? I reckon that might just work. Let's find a tap or lever or some. One. You hear the distant sounds of running water? The ocean floor was my domain. I dined on fish to keep me sane. What was that? What was what? Nothing. I must be hearing things. What is this? What are we going to go back to? Oh, that actually worked. Nice job, Buffy. Let's press on. <gasps> it's a freaking cockroach. A foul roach. Just a wee bug. We've got this. So you're literally not going to help? Nah, bother. You got this. Oh, fine. Help me out, Shaban. <laughs> He's going to help, though. He's going to help in the background. Or not. He's not even in the fight. What? Deal two slashes in a row. Let's try cleave. Whoa! Worm fire, baby. Ow! Cleave again. You're done for, son. Thanks, squirrel. Chest. We found a button shield. Did the previous adventure drop this? Upcycle from gutter's end. Plus one. Plus one defense. So you've got four defense. Three defense. Let's let's give this one to. Oh my god. Yeah, yeah. Let's give everyone four defense. That sounds good. We need we need a protection ban. Oh, another one. Looks like another block pipe, fellas. What a pain. No point, Dodlin. Let's solve this. That's number two. There's 
number one. This is number three. So two first, I guess. You hear the hiss of building pressure. It's gonna singing again. Is it gonna sing again? You hear the distant sound of running water. The sea went dry as fish ran few. I ventured far for something new. Do you hear that? It's the gurgle of the pipes, lad. I think I heard it too. It's a voice, but not one from any road and I know. It's a big toad or something. Another pipe unclogged and clogged of god filth. Hey, mouse, I can't help but notice. You didn't have a tail. So what? Just curious where it went, Sol. The yellow god took it. Yellow god? Sir Verm is looking for him. We're headed to Merida to find leads. Then I'm gonna kill him. Wait, what? A mouse wants to kill a god? You're one mad lad. Two of them. You've got to help this time, Squizzle. Come on. Right, this time we're gonna have to we're gonna have to rage. This is super cool. Blast you with fire. It's not like a super attack or anything, but it gets you. And then you, we're gonna cleave this guy, because it should be berserk cleave, so it should do like double damage twice, which is pretty insane. Yeah! That was awesome. Blasted. Come on. One attack should be fine. With berser one, one berserk attack should easily do this. Chopped. Nice. I thought we'd be complaining about this guy not helping us out. Another blackguard. This is getting tedious. Last one, I swear. Murder's is right on the other side of this pipe. Hey, Bruce, why are we headed to Murder anyway? Going to busk for seeds? Not quite. I'm meeting up with my, bu my bandmate. And we're going to head to Sky Garden for the music for the Squirrel Duke. Oh, I've always wanted to see Sky Garden. Don't bother. I hear squirrels there are a violent bunch. Boom, that's so rude. Nay, it's true. Sky Garden's ruled, o ruled over by Clan Grey. They've long earned their reputation as a bunch of nasty bamboots. Uh, anyway, let's get over with. Right, so we need to find... That's, that says five, so we want number four. Uh, right, we gotta fight those. Okay, now we've got like a labyrinth. We're gonna have to go everywhere. Oh shit! It's like you found an avarice spider. It's a freaking battle. It's like a mimic. <laughs> Let's just okay. Great. Um, cleave. Attack. Worm fire. If you're gonna throw seeds, I should be able to keep the seeds. Attack, we'll, we'll rage then. We don't know how long this fight's gonna be. Get out of the box, you little twerp. Worm fire again. It's defending, but I'm defending. I'm defending. I'm gonna waste his turn on that. Ow, freaking seeds. Now I'm gonna double, double berserk cleave you. 24 damage, that's pretty sweet. We're gonna set you on fire. Yeah! Only six, that's not great. Rage subsided. Yeah, we're gonna defend again. Defend. Could use a peanut. I think his, your health restores every battle, every combat, which is cool. So, we'll cleave again. Right, we got him. We got him. Uh, you packed up an insect park. Gross, why did you do that? You added to your trinkets nonetheless. Why'd you pick this up? Gross. Okay. Insect parts are just collectibles in the game, I guess. You just try and get them all. Oh my god, it's a headless statue. It's a copper statue of some kind of warrior. It seems to have been damaged by the elements. The head is missing and the plaque has eroded beyond comprehension. The name of the warrior still stands. Save your game. Yeah. I like how each battle is like its own challenge then. Well, that's four. We need to do this one. 
building pressure. And then we go back over here, put on five, and then we're gonna have to fight some cockroaches. Building pressure. Time for to fight three cockroaches. You've got to help us now, squirrel. Come on! I'm gonna have to rage. I'm gonna kill two of these guys easily, so you are gonna focus on the third one. Shaban, you focus on the third one. Having that shield, I think, was a really good idea, having a shield on Shaban. Attack, we're gonna cleave, berserk, cleave this guy for 30 damage. That might be an insta-kill, yeah? Yeah. And then Shaban, if you attack the third one again, when I attack that one, you can kill that third one, probably. Oh no! Swipe. You know what? We'll swipe this one then. Make sure he's dead, and then we'll attack these one, this one together. I'm gonna defend. And then... I'll also defend. Wormfire. When we defend, we get an extra thing from, from Shaban. I forgot about that. That's awesome. Leave. Yeah. How are you not dead? You're dead now. Get burnt, cockroach. Yeah, I like how each each fight's like its own challenge, which is you know it's not like a grind JRPG. It's not even it doesn't even really have exploration. It's just like um, this is the most open area that we've found, and we still have to go to every single room essentially. So it's not like it's. It's like on rails, but because the fights, uh, pursuing tastes of sweeter meats, I brave foul streams for gourmet treats. That sounded pretty close. Ah, yeah, can't deny I heard that one. What did you get us into, clown? We're gonna have to go fight her like a toad or something now. Yeah, it's 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 more about solving the puzzle. It's a freaking octopus! What is that? Just a wee bug, you've got this. That's not a bug, you flea and fool. Looks like the deep sea denizens I've read about. Did it come all this way for a meal? Now here I stand, thy thy lives forsaken. Commit my name and I am, for I am a kraken. Does it open up? Does it? I don't know if it does though. Maybe, maybe this is like, supposed to be like this. Bruce, we could really use your help with this. Yes. Yes, I right you are. I'll play a tune to raise your spirits. That's not helpful. It is though. You don't understand it is. Rage. Oh shit, the music's so good! Right, worm fire. Boom. Resist, of course, fire's no good. Attack. Encore gives a bonus turn to an ally. Slightly heals one ally. We got Encore, we got one called Verm. It's all about Verm right now. This is too... The fucking music's so good. Um, this game is amazing. Right. Nerve toxin. Shit. Stunned. Oh, damn. Right, you're gonna have to just smack then. You're gonna be focused on smacking. Super! So, it, like, bashing damage is gonna be good for it. In that case, um... I'm gonna... I'm gonna... Yep, yep, yep. Give this guy an extra turn, because he's gonna have to use his stun anyway. Rage subsided, so we're gonna use Rage again. I'll dash you into Calamari. Attack, cleave. We don't have enough. Attack. We just have to keep swiping. You're just gonna keep smacking. You've got a peanut ready for when we need to heal somebody. You are gonna defend this turn, Bruce. I need you to encore. Ooh, it was a full full attack. Swipe. Nice, nice. Um, you are going to... There's no peanuts! Oh, shit. It's not you who has a peanut. It's, um... It's Verm. You're just gonna have to get smacked then. Because the bashing damage is really good. In that case, I'm gonna attack. You know what? I could... I'm gonna encore Verm. Let him use the peanut instead. Because I think it's probably gonna heal more. Rage subsided. Item peanut on peanut on Shaban. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stunned again, god damn it. Doesn't matter. I think she's one of his main sources of damage is Shaban. Nine super is great. 
Attack. Keep giving Encore to Verm. Attack. Uh, let's cleave. It, it might be linear. That's a shame. No, dude. I think that's awesome. That means there's no grindy nonsense combat. It's just an awesome story that seems to be written really well and each each fight is like tailored is like a tailored puzzle instead of just being like tap attack until the enemy dies which is why i hate about jrpgs what strengths of shiny creatures bear you force my flight to an empty lair yeah boy shaban learned overclock what did i tell you just a wee bug an ocean monster doesn't count as a wee bug. Nay, Bob, you had it in the bag. I don't appreciate being deceived. I got no tide. Oh, yeah, then why wear a mask? Why are you two fighting? We're nearly at Merida. Your mole friend is right. What's done is done. Near point squabbling. I guess. All right, to Merida. This is Merida? You've reached the end of the demo. Would you like to save your game? Yes, if it means I can continue from here when I play the real game, which I definitely do, will. You haven't played... My I've played tons of RPGs. It's all I used to play as a kid, and then I realized I've got better things to do. <laughs> That's only Pokemon. Pokemon is definitely the worst offender. Uh, the, the, the worst one. Pokemon is just... Or horrible. It's terrible. You just tap here... It was really annoying. Um, but yeah, too many RPGs fall into that trope of just tapping. Just go through every fight the same way. Oh, it takes a really long time for the fights to get good. And I mean like 20 hours. That's too much time wasted. That I really like because it's more like... It's more like a puzzle than, than an app. Do you know what I mean? It's more like I'm solving a puzzle with my limited actions and stuff like that. Um, I haven't played, I, yeah, I don't play RPG. I just don't play RPGs anymore because I know I don't, I'm not going to like them and they, all, they always take 60 hours. It's just, I just, I'd never find them worth it. Um, even like action RPGs when the, the annoying ones like um, uh, Tales, the Tales series, oh god, they're still so boring to me. They're so boring, even though it's like a bit, it's like action RPG as well. Because it, it's, it's still turn-based, but you're like still running around and doing stuff. Uh, no, man, they kill me. But that was awesome. That was so good. Small saga. I love what they've done with that. Each fight is tailored, it seems, instead of just being, you know, nothing for a lot of it. And the story was awesome. It proper got me in the beginning. I, I loved it. I loved it. It looked beautiful. That was super cool. That small saga, I'm going to give that a five. Just a perfect. I can't wait to play that. It's immediate wish list. Um, that's an immediate wish list. That, that I'm, I'm wishlisting it right now. Can't wait when that comes out. It just says coming soon, which is a shame because it might mean, you know, next year. Yeah, small saga. I'm well happy we played that. Hour and 20 minutes as well. The thing is with, with one like that as well, with a, with, I like that we can... I like that we can um, save it and then come back in hopefully in the full game. But that was just super cool. The, the writing was really good. The combat was fun. Uh, and like I say, it was like a puzzle and you can kind of build into certain strats that you want to use with your, with your leveling up and your leveling up is like a skill tree instead of just being like, you know, you get base stats and stuff. I like skill trees and stuff like that as well in games. That was cool. That was a really cool. Small saga. Yeah. Best RPG I've played. 